thinking of jumping? Think again. I'm not thinking of jumping. I'm fishing. Then where's your fishing pole? It fell in the river. I'm, I'm trying to get it back. Just because you didn't win the last election and you've turned out of your cushy job doesn't mean it's over for you. On second thought, maybe you should jump. Just kidding. Be careful. That's not a river raging water below. That's a dry sewer. It's the LA River. You think the world would be a better place without you in it? Let me show you a few things to try and change your mind. Come with me. Why is it snowing? We're in Southern California. We don't have snow here. Well, who the hell are you supposed to be? Who am I? I'm your guardian angel. I was sent from above to try to set you straight. If I succeed, I will earn my angel wings. You know, every time you hear the sound of a bell ringing, and it yeah, 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 it just means that someone got a text message on their cell phone. Wait, this is where the orange busway is supposed to be. Where did it go? You see, Dennis, you are not part of this world to pass legislation to get the busway. Therefore, no busway. How do people get around without it? Oh, they have other ways to commute. They finally built that monorail everybody was talking about. It's quite efficient. Come on, I got a couple other things to show you. Wait a minute. This is supposed to be the Warner Center. Where are the buildings? Where's Westfield? Where's Costco? Costco? You really want to go there? A nearby aerospace facility had a toxic accident and scared all the businesses away. Had you been here, you would have fought for tougher laws and restrictions, and we wouldn't have this mess. What the? What happened to the Madrid Theater? It's a strip club now. What happened to Fleming's? Gone. Roy's? Gone. Sagebrush Cantina? Gone. My Fourth of July extravaganza? Gone. Charlie Tuna? Oh, him. He's OK. He's on K-Earth 101. K-Earth 101. How about the Z Awards? You mean the Chick Awards. Laura Chick started that upon the appointment of her third term just before Mayor Justin Bieber appointed her the permanent county supervisor. Let me show you how much your people in your district appreciate you before you thought about jumping off that bridge. Dennis, working with you these past 12 years has been a privilege and an honor. You've dedicated over 40 years of your life to the people of the city of Los Angeles and particularly those of the West San Fernando Valley as a councilman and before that as an LAPD officer. Thank you for being my friend. The West San Fernando Valley is better today because of your generosity and your commitment. Um, I was about to say that I'll miss working with you, but I know in fact we'll be working together in the years to come uh, for the people of the West San Fernando Valley. And I wish you nothing, nothing but the best over the years to come. Dennis, I was reminiscing with my medical marijuana plant over here about the last 30 years that you and I have worked together First, when I was a young pup in Marvin Browdy's office, and then over the past 12 years as you being the city councilman. And it's been a wonderful, wonderful time. Um, I really look forward to another 30 years of hanging out with you and having some good times and great memories. All the best to you, Dennis, and look forward to the next 30. Dennis, you've always been so good to me. You've asked me when I wanted to go to an event, just use your name. I've done better. Yes, I've used your face. And as far as volunteering, you're the only one who ever fired me from a volunteer job. Last but not least, thank you for making me one of your pioneer women.
Just a quick note to say thank you on behalf of the Miller family, and I'd like to say that if Michael were here, he'd probably be soliciting Arnie Kleiner to make your career into a movie. So let's be grateful for once that we don't have Michael. But uh, in the big picture, thank you for always staying true to the cause, always staying true to your constituents, and really leading with your heart and not always with different agendas and always making the community part of your term in office. You've been phenomenal and this community has been so much better with you and there just aren't enough words to say thank you. Dennis, you don't have to kill yourself. Your picture's in the paper this week. In all honesty and in all sincerity, I have to say in the 30 years I've been in the newspaper business, uh, you have been one of the easiest, most friendly, most uh, invested politicians that we've had in this community. Um, I kid you about being in the paper, but it's only because you've done so much and you've showed up so much and you've cared so much about the West Valley that we're able to uh, laud you for your efforts within the pages of the newspaper. We are certainly going to miss you and we hope that you are on to something more exciting and newsworthy so I can put you in the paper again. Good luck and congratulations. I'm here to say I love you, I owe everything to you, I'm going to miss you, we sorely needed you in the district and we certainly needed you in the city, but you're going to help us out no matter what. Love you and stay well. We love you Dennis! Seriously, thank you so much Dennis for all that you've done for the community and for showing up for the past 12 years. Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot for old Dennis For old Dennis my friend, for old Dennis you'll find another office yet for old